the latest AQW trend has been really expensive chess. Let's talk about it. When my homies pull up on your block, they make that thing go da 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 Okay, this is not a news video. I just really want to talk about this 10k chest and what it means for the game, of course. Now, if we look at the sign notes post, we can see everything that is in the chest, uh, at least that we know about at this point. Now, I do have a few questions about the items that are in the chest that I can't answer myself, and there are no further info on Twitter. So, it says this comes with the exclusive color custom Enchanted Vampire Lore class. So having a color custom class is not really that much of a benefit. It's a cool idea, but you'd have to use the class. And if the class isn't good, then you're not going to be using the class. And that's a waste of a color custom armor. So I would much rather that be an armor and not a class. But uh, yeah, that's still, that's pretty cool. And I also wish that it wasn't, of course, locked in a 10k chest. But uh, yeah, we will talk about that in a little bit. You get the vampire clean queen memorial statue with quest for rare character page badge that's cool uh, you can see a statue right there in the background it's got two candles on it blood coming out of the skull and you got the aqw sephiria there holding the skull so also you get the dark butler pet with house item shop that's the dark butler right there uh five event armors and accessories so the five event armors and accessories you're basically pre-ordering armors so they say that the event's going to go on for three weeks and you're getting all the ac items that are releasing for the three weeks of the event with the blood moon chest so that's 10k acs for three weeks plus a class so yeah very uh pretty expensive items for three weeks worth of items uh, at least for my spending habits uh vampire lord castle house now if this castle house does not have character customization or at least armor customization is really not worth it so hopefully they include that in a vampire lord castle that sounds pretty badass hopefully it uh, lives up to that name uh so we don't really know much about this and i would not recommend buying it before you see what's in it uh, i'm gonna purchase it i actually think this is a better deal than the talk like a pirate day dragonborn one uh, because you get a color custom version and not 20,000 recolors so at least they realize that hey having 20 recolors in a chest probably isn't a good idea and is a huge waste of inventory space let's just have a color custom version that makes a lot more sense so yeah it's definitely a better deal uh you also get a bank pet the vampire dragon bank pet i think i glossed over that the bank pet's right there it's just the basic baby dragon except with a little vampire theme with golems back so you get a bank pet a color custom class uh house items a house to put those items in five rare armors and accessories and uh some blood moon chest gear is the exclusive enchanted vampire lord set vampire masquerade armor set vampire shifter armor a gender swap version of the vampire lord class royal vampire renegade armor and helmet uh, which is on Elaine's Twitter right now, and the dark stuff, whatever that word is, armor set. Uh, I looked that up on Google, and it's like a creepy uh, Smeagol-looking thing. I, so that's probably not going to be a good, very good armor set, but we'll see what what happens with that. So, and maybe the Enchanted Vampire Lord set is the color custom uh, version of that, since it's Enchanted Vampire Lord class. So maybe it's. Yeah, maybe those, that's actually what I was talking about when I said there should be a color custom version of the class. We'll have to wait and see. Um, so I really wouldn't recommend buying this until you actually, until the items are in game. I'll make a video showing every item you get with it for the first week. But there's three weeks worth of items. So you're basically pre-ordering items in a Flash game, which uh, I never pre-order games in real life and pre-ordering items in a game is kind of weird like items we haven't even seen the art for you're kind of pre-ordering them by buying this the first week it comes out so i would not recommend buying it the first week it comes out uh because you're not going to know what's what's in there unless you, you plan on buying the items either way and if you're just going to blindly buy the items anyway then i mean then this item is for you so okay uh alina on twitter also said the holiday okay someone asks are you gonna make the 10k ac uh, chest a regular thing and i don't think it should always be 10k ac 
Like, we could have a 5k AC chest for certain events, or a 8k AC chest, or a, uh, I don't know, like, a, the, it, the price doesn't have to be set at 10k AC every time. I hope they realize that, because uh, 10k AC is, is $40. It's a lot of money uh, for a bunch of, for a few items. Uh, the holiday events are the most likely times we'd release an event rare chest. They will not be part of the weekly updates. So at least we're not getting this for weekly updates. I know some people are upset about the 10k AC chest. Now, I had a uh, conversation with Mehmet here on Twitter. Uh, you can go read this. I'll leave a link to it in the description. And basically, she was just... Or, uh, Mehmet, yeah, Mehmet was just asking whether or not... I don't know if Mehmet says she or he. I think, I think Mehmet says she. I, I'm not... 100% on that. Um, it's hard to keep track of all the AE staff. Um, just asking different questions and stuff. So they are taking into consideration our thoughts on this, which is good. They're not just uh, going at it blindly. But yeah, there is a few. I do have another issue where uh, you're buying, you're spending 10k ACs on this chest. Are you going to get the rare version of the class that's coming out? So. There is a rare, a second version with some, the same skills but different art that will go rare. Are you also getting that on top of the color custom version? Or are you going to have to spend 10k AC on this uh, to get the color custom version of the class? And then another 2k AC to get the rare version of the class. And then you can also get the farming version to have all three versions of the classes coming out. Uh, or maybe by this they meant a second rare version of the same art. Maybe well because this post is older so maybe there isn't a third vampire lore class maybe that was what they're talking about when uh they meant this before they announced this because this was just announced uh like less than 24 hours ago so yeah that's about all my thoughts i would highly recommend you wait just wait uh wait for the third week wait till all the items are out uh, i think by then we'll know whether or not it's actually a good value and uh yeah I think it's pretty okay. I I really don't think they should do this that often though. I much rather prefer like much rather prefer they sell every item separately and it really sucks that they're locking certain house items and pets and other things and how not they're not locking houses but uh like yeah, certain sets of armor and stuff like that behind uh, the 10k AC paywall so if you wanted to get that without spending 10k ACs it would be impossible I, I really don't like that so I hope they don't do this too often and hopefully next time they do it uh, I don't know they tone it down a little bit so thanks for watching that's all my thoughts on that uh, tell me your thoughts in the comment section but down below I'm pretty sure it's gonna be pretty divided I am gonna buy it uh, I do have 10k AC if I didn't have 10k AC I'd be pretty I'd be this would probably be a rage video <laughs> Uh, so it depends on like what you can afford really and it, yeah, it would really suck if I didn't have 10k AC because Some of the stuff here like color custom class seems really cool And if you haven't seen the uh, class design for that that was in the intro uh, for the female version of the vampire class uh, That is about it for this video guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Leave a like if you did subscribe if you're not Already and there will of course be a news video tomorrow regularly scheduled news video We have a bunch of news for that I already have a bunch of bookmarks saved for that and I'll see you guys all in the next one peace